body. We are in the ice age now. It's a moment in larger horizontal one. 20 by 24 inches negative and cold light source. It's not just a cold light source, it's really, really cold light source. Ten thousands of LEDs. the truth about uh, this enlarger it's not automatic it <laughs> operates by <laughs> by a special Only one person is yeah. inside the enlarger and he does, does all the movement <laughs> simply give him bread and water and everything is okay okay sometimes a beer <laughs> Сколько весит? Думаю, килограмм 120. Здесь могла бы быть ваша реклама. You're more or less happy now? Yeah. More. <laughs> more. <laughs> of L looks like the things are going all right. Yeah. Yeah, yesterday we installed the various uh, stations or the standards of the enlarger. First the light source and the negative carrier and the negative holder and finally <coughs> the lens carrier unit. We also installed the bellow support and uh, we managed to to switch on the light, enlarger light and so on. So everything is now ready for uh, the final calibration procedure. That's the result. So the declination of the curve is not, not so problem, it's only a, a question of the alignment of the, of the measuring system. But you will see here the numbers and though that means the minimum is here, zero, minus 0 0.019, which is close to two hundredths of a millimeter, and the maximum is 0 0.026, which is two and a half one hundredths of a millimeter. So the maximum variation is less than five hundredths of a millimeter. And what is the distance of the rails? Approximately 1 meter 20. This is the same 
stick here in between in different positions and then again uh, I check the alignment with different long sticks so for different focal distances and you see now it's uh, let's say now 508 uh -huh. and I turn it around everything is well and now it's another distance yeah and I record all the distances and then calculate automatically the difference in the distance which is the same as the tilt and shift of the both plates with a lot of different parameters and it seems to work really well the system itself that must be consistent if not uh, you cannot do any alignment so that's the way we measure the distance in between the both units and that should be within a range of less than half a millimeter of five tenths of a millimeter this is very precise for the big dimensions of 1300 millimeters in total See the next episode. Jürgen Highland connected to the Matrix. Euro washes an anti Newton glass. Euro washes a museum glass. Euro washes black and white photos. Jürgen Highland washes the enlarger. Anton is training for the competition. Yeah, you have to be strong guy. Train every day. <laughs> then you can print ultra large form. Thank you.